upside down with excitement. That's how Alex Wagner, a 44-year-old veteran of politics-focused TV journalism confessed to feeling after having gotten the nod from MSNBC to succeed Rachel Maddow, the latter, of course, being the network's biggest ratings draw and who left the network with a Karusha. With the Wagner announcement, MSNBC has now, for the most part, answered that question, leaving CNN as the only network with uncertainty still hanging over its 9 p.m. hour. The MSNBC rival, though, is apparently in no rush to name a permanent replacement for Chris Cuomo, and is content to use a rotating series of hosts in the time slot for now. As for MSNBC settling this question for itself for the most part, that's a reference to the fact that Wagner isn't completely taking over for Matt Al. The latter will, for now, still helm the 9 p.m. hour on Monday nights, with Wagner hosting her yet-to-be-named program Tuesday to Friday. Fox News, meanwhile, wasted no time in taking a jab at the competition while reporting on Matt Al's successor giving its treatment of the news perhaps the sauciest headline that the perennially number one cable news network's digital arm could have come up with, MSNBC taps Alex Wagner to fill Rachel Maddow. Rival network sniping aside, the fact remains that Wagner is about to become one of the most high-profile and important women in cable news, and, also, the only Asian American to host a primetime cable news program once her show launches on August 16. The network pointed me to the following statement from Wagner, who said today that I'm honored to be anchoring a key hour of television in such a critical time for American democracy. In many ways, the stakes have never been higher, and there's no better place to explore this moment than MSNBC. I'm thrilled to be coming home. Maddow transitioned to hosting just one night a week in May, telling viewers of the Rachel Maddow show that it's partly about giving herself just more time to work on some of this other stuff that I've got cooking for MSNBC and NBC. Wagner's appointment, meanwhile. As ratings at both CNN and MSNBC have declined while Fox News continues to see an increase, Wagner will also sit at the center of a programming strategy at MSNBC that calls for an increasing constellation of content orbiting around its shows and top draw stars, spanning podcasts and newsletters, as this, by the way, is an approach that CNN under new boss Chris Lick thinks is the way forward there, as well, as the ratings-obsessed cable news business continues to grapple with how much of its emphasis ought to shift toward digital formats.